Hey guys, Steve here with Belt of Truth Ministries. I've got Jeff Fisher on the line. Jeff is the founder of PurityCoaching.com, PornToPurity.com, and he also hosts the Top Tips for Sexual Purity podcast, which you can find on iTunes. So Jeff, let me uh, go ahead and ask you, what's the one piece of advice that you would give to somebody struggling with porn addiction? Hey Steve, I'm glad to be on your show and, um, and everybody out there. I think one of the biggest tips that I've learned in the process is that we need to keep coming out of isolation. There's an initial coming out of isolation where I share my secret story. I share the things that I've been hiding and covering up for so long. And, you know, that initial share is one of the hardest things to get over, but finding somebody safe, finding an old friend, maybe paying to go to somebody who's confidential like a counselor or even uh, setting an appointment with a minister, finding somebody where you can break the ice. Once you break the ice and start to talk about the the struggles within in regards to your sexual purity, then it's it, it's like God is just there and it's this free, it's this freeing up feeling and this, this fountain of um, relief and, and um, it, it's hard to describe that I can finally talk to somebody openly about what's going on. It's still scary and it still takes a lot of courage, but uh, that initial share, and, and maybe I haven't talked about it in a long time, or I haven't talked about the, really the deeper things. And that's what I mean is, is going to those levels where you're, where you're breaking the isolation and you're sharing. And, but, you know, the tip is to keep doing that. Uh, we who are in recovery from our sexual struggles have to keep doing that on a regular basis. It, it, it gets easier um, as we work through the pain and the difficult things and, and people are good for it then um, I feel comfortable to share more and I can build trust. I think sometimes that I need to go to somebody like like you, Stephen, or somebody like you know our ministry or another ministry that is uh, equipped and is used to hearing people's struggles. Sometimes we can do enough work on the front end to find uh, you know a minister or a counselor who is is used to talking to people about their sexual struggles. But I think that is one of the benefits of ministries like ours. We're automatic, safe people that we're, we're not going to flinch. Uh, it's not that we've heard it all, but we've heard a whole lot. And uh, everybody thinks that their story is unique and the worst. And it's not. It's very common. But we just are not around people that talk about it. Uh, to know that our struggle is is a common thing. And sometimes the, the depths and the wits of our struggle, you know, might be more unique, but just the core of our struggle. Uh, for seven years ago was when uh, the, the stuff hit the fan for me. I, I got caught, I got exposed, and I was kind of forced out. But then I had to still make a decision to keep sharing. So I, admitting that I had looked at bad stuff on the computer was one thing. But then to keep sharing and keep opening up, uh, you know, that's that's where God started to bless. And that's where I started to find the healing that I needed uh, from the Lord. I think that's that's great advice. The uh, you know, we refer to that as walking in the light. And mm -hmm. I know that was that was hugely important when I started recovery was just getting comfortable sharing my story. And, and yeah. yeah, it's a. Uh, I couldn't agree agree with you more. So thanks thanks for sharing that, Jeff. Tell uh, tell people where they can find you online. Yeah, sure. Um, uh, my wife and I, um, uh, Marsha, and I, uh, we started porntopurity.com about uh, seven years ago, just as a, a way to blog about our struggles. And then it started to turn into a podcast. And so I started a podcast called Top Tips for Sexual Purity. And you can find that on iTunes. That's the best place to search for it. There's a huge catalog, huge back catalog of episodes. So download whatever ones that you feel are, uh, are good for you. And then our latest website is called puritycoaching.com. And that's where we offer our support groups. I offer a, a unique thing called accountability jump starts where I can 
help you get started in your accountability for one, two, or three months. I can be your accountability partner. Um, and then there's regular coaching where there's a more comprehensive, in-depth help to build your purity strategy so that it goes for the long term. Okay. Well, we'll be sure to link to all that in the show notes. Uh, thanks again for your time, Jeff. Really appreciate it. And uh, we'll keep in touch. Yeah, thanks a lot. Okay, see ya.